And welcome back. We had mainly cloudy skies into the Fargo area as we went through the day today. Temperatures uh, near normal for this time of year. We saw a high near 20 degrees. Most of the snow staying well off to the west and to the south. Now the uh, current temperature out there into the Fargo area uh, up to uh, 18 degrees. Grand Forks at 14. So is Crookston, Thief River Falls. Lower teens out toward Devil's Lake. And we're seeing temperatures still near 20 degrees at Wapaton, Fergus Falls, and Detroit Lakes. Now the satellite loop over the last six hours showing mainly cloudy skies across the region. Still that band of some snow showers just to the south of Bismarck. And we're also tracking some snow developing just to the south of Jamestown and into the Sisseton area. We're looking at some... Um, very light accumulations from this, if any. Also, we're seeing uh, some uh, some snow showers, snow flurries out toward Fergus Falls and Park Rapids. It is the last remnants of this system that moved to our south and to our east. It's now over Maine right now. We are still seeing some snow into portions of Wisconsin, and uh, they're seeing some accumulating snow uh, out that way. But that's basically it. For uh, the weather systems that we've been tracking uh, across the country, have some snow in portions of northern Texas, but just cloudy skies out there as you look off to our west. And with that northerly flow, it is a lot cooler. So that, that's the weather we're going to see as we go through the next couple of days. As we go through this evening, and especially during the early overnight period, any of us could see some snow showers from this system. Most of the activity is out of here by tomorrow morning, and we will see temperatures staying into the lower teens for lows. We're not going to go very far tomorrow in terms of temperatures. We should only be near 18 degrees for a high into the Fargo area. And we're going to keep mainly cloudy skies as we go through Wednesday night and through the day on Thursday. Thursday is going to be another cool day. We're going to see a clearing trend as we go through Thursday night and especially into the day on Friday and into the weekend. Some isolated areas of one inch accumulation out toward the Fergus Falls area. Everybody else could see a trace or a half an inch from this one. So not a big system as uh, we get rid of that storm system that took a while to leave but is leaving. Now there's your few snow showers tomorrow morning at 730. Mostly cloudy skies, 11 degrees into the Fargo area, 18 by noon. We are going to see mostly cloudy skies and then we're going to keep mostly cloudy skies 16 as we go through your 5 p.m. hour. Now, now your afternoon planner looks like this into the southern valley. Temperatures mainly into the upper teens. We're going to say mostly cloudy skies, chilly, lower 20s out toward lakes country. They'll see cloudy skies, maybe a, uh, a stray snow flurry out there, but that's basically it. Upper teens to near 20 into a northland and cooler air as you make your way into the northern valley. Temperatures within a few degrees of 17 everywhere you look. Now extending the forecast, we're going to see the cloudy skies and the cool air continue a high of 16 for your Thursday. And then we've got sunny skies on Friday, a high of 24. Now, the weekend looks pretty nice. Temperatures rising into the upper 20s with a sunny or mostly sunny skies for your Saturday and Sunday. And near 30 on Monday with sunshine, partly cloudy skies, high of 25 for your Tuesday. So temperatures getting above normal, especially that near 30 degree day for Monday. Wow, not bad at all to start 2016 on that note. <laughs> yep, and it comes with a lot of sunshine, good. so that'll be good too. All right, thanks, Justin. Yep. Well, after some time off for the holidays, the Bison are back at it, working toward their fifth consecutive national championship. Hear from the players later in sports. And are you needing some help with that New Year's resolution? We have some suggestions coming up next.